everyone. Thanks for stopping in today to see what I am up to. I have this box right here. This box technically is empty right now because I just filmed this video and it, the video never captured on my camera. I'm like, no, I don't want to have to refilm today. So this box here with all the question marks is from, and I'll show you real fast. This is from ColourPop, and this is their Mega Mystery Bundle. And literally just was taking my photos and was like, where's the video? Because it usually pops up there first. So now, as you can see, I have all kinds of swatches on my hand. So I'm going to redo it. I mean, I'm still excited about it. I mean, I just got done and I was like no I've never had it not capture the video yes I've had issues on uploads and had to refilm parts of it jumbled and things like that but I don't understand why but let me go back to my phone to ColourPop and tell you the prices of everything they have three mystery bundles they are still available one is called Secret Stash it's a $29 $61 value um cp confidential is like the that was the small one this is the medium size 49 dollars 102 dollar value and this is the mega mystery and this was 89 dollars and like i said still available uh for this one it says these hidden treasures are a mystery our Mega Mystery Box delivers our biggest surprise assortment of ColourPop must-haves plus new merch. If you were to buy these secret items individually, it would cost you over $200. What hidden gems will you find in your mystery box? Well, let's find out. Once again. Well, for me, once again, for you the very first time. Very first product I have here. And 4th Ray Beauty is their sister company. So from 4th Ray Beauty, we have Coconut Body Milk. And this was open like this when it came, so I didn't have to open it. And this you put on, and this is a liquid. And um, you put this on after you get out of the shower while you're still damp. And it absorbs so fast into your body. I love lotion like that in general. So let's just do all like the 4th Ray and the Soul Body. So this is from Soul Body. Their Shimmering Dry Oil. And this would be nice on your arms, your legs, your decollete. If you're brave, you could put this maybe like on your cheekbones. You could use that for whatever you see fit to use that for. But that's nice. The next one, and this is really nice, 4-3 Beauty. Again, this is the Matcha Face Milk. So this is just like a, a moisture booster. Uh, a creamy, lightweight moisture booster to refresh tired skin I mean, we all have tired skin unless you're young and this is just like a very light color green these are glass bottles with a dropper so these are all very nice i don't i have two things from fourth ray I'm trying to think what they are i honestly don't know but i love like color pops palettes and lip scrubs and their lipsticks and the last time i bought anything from color pop was probably well over a year ago i did a huge haul and used a lot of it for giveaways. Kept a few palettes for myself. So this is strawberry and papaya face milk from 4th Ray Beauty. I did smell this in my original video right here. Like a nice strawberry pink. This smells so good. Mm, like you could just do a shot. You can, but it smells like you could. And then the last from 4th Ray, which I think this is the last thing from 4th Ray Beauty. This is turmeric brightening serum boost turmeric is very good turmeric right turmeric very good for your skin if you have any issues damage this is very healing very good for your skin it doesn't stain your skin nice glass bottle and a dropper love that so there's five items then what did i do next I'm trying to keep it in the same order from ColourPop, we have two single shadows, pressed powdered shadow. There's the first one, and this is top notch. I'll show you the back. Hopefully that will pop up. And this one is Get Kraken. Let's try to keep that in the center so that I can show you the back. 
So if I don't keep them, I'll share them, but I have plenty of um, Z palettes that I could put them in. Next product is a cream gel color. And this is in Dimples. And that's right here, a little pot. Obviously this is a blush. You could use it on your lips if you wanted to. You can do whatever you want, it's yours. So that's that, happy to have that. I've been loving a lot of the creamer, the cream, the creamer, the creamier products um, as my skin ages. The next thing is Super Shock Cheek. I have it out already because obviously I took a photo. And this, uh, did it have a shade? Oops. Let's rescue that. It did have a shade. And this is Lunch Money. I'll show you the back. Lunch Money. And I did swatch this and I'll show it to you on my hand. This was so buttery. So buttery. Oh, Super Shock um, Cheeks and their um, shadows and stuff are wonderful. I think I have a couple of Super Shock shadows that I love. And that is right over here on my hand. If you can see it. Beautiful. Perfect for me. And I'm not always like a shimmer highlighter, but that is gorgeous. This next product is a cream shadow. I think there were 23 items in this box. Bronco is the shade or tone, whatever you want to call that. I love the packaging of this. Make sure I hold it up right, right here. This is really nice. This would be a great like all over lid color. Cream, which uh, creams, just make sure you set with powder so that they don't crease. And then here, this is Jelly Much. And this is just the packaging. Let's get this open and I'll tell you the shade. And this is Mystical. So this is what this looks like. I don't know if that's loose or not in there, but I'm not going to open that. Um, I doubt that I'll keep that, honestly. You never know, honestly. Then let's just get into, then there was all this. Oops, something just fell out. All this right here. And that came out of somewhere right here. So in here were two here Act Natural Defining Mascaras. As you can see here, one's black, one's brown. I'm not going to open these. I, I don't know if I'll keep the black, honestly, just because it's a full size. And I might share that. The brown, though, I might keep that because I don't have brown. Um, and hopefully use it so that it doesn't... Um, you know, go bad. Ultra glossy lip. And the shade is Here's to You. And I think I did, no, I did not swatch the gloss. Very nice though. I didn't swatch that the first round. I don't want to. Let's do this next. The Ultra Blotted Lip. And this is in Vitamin C. As you can see that right there. I love how they did that vitamin C, S-E-A. Beautiful right here. And I did swatch this, so I'll show it to you on my hand. Hmm. That is this one right here. Pretty. Then here we have a liquid liner. Oh, no, that just went flying. <laughs> okay. No, where did this come out of? I came out of one of these. I'll get that in a second. We have, well, let's move on. We have a lippy stick. And this one is, who run this? And this is what the tube looks like. And here's the shade. This, was this the stick? I, I remember where I put them on my hand. So this is what it looks like. And that is right here on my hand. Great fall colors. Great. I mean, I don't care. I'll wear whatever shade I want to wear whenever I want to wear it. This here is another lippy stick. And this is Trust Me. So another lippy stick. Trust Me. This one I won't keep. 
because of the red. So I might, I will share that. So that's those two. This was fun. This is a cream gel liner right here. And this is in Electric Daisy. Okay, look at this too. That is bright. And obviously you can pick that out on my hand, the bright green. I'm not angry at that. I've been loving colored liners. Happy to have a non-black. We'll save that because I have to get up. Uh, here's a lippy pencil. And this is in Field Day. I don't like that is white. So that might be difficult. This. Where did I put this? So I might just swatch this one again. But where do I put it? Right here. Because I don't remember where that one is on my hand. Happy for that too. I'm not, uh, like I said, love. And then this one here is a cream gel pencil. And this is in So Happy. Here's right there. And I'll re swatch this one too. This is the tube. Just because I honestly don't remember where. And these are so creamy. And that's this one right here. Love these. I love filling in like I did today all over lip and then put a lipstick on top. Okay, so I will get that. I don't know if I had my little, give me one second and let me get what flew and then I have three more products to show you. Okay, I, I rescued it. This is a liquid liner right here. And this is unusual. This is in Honey Girl. Um, this is the tone, and I don't know where is the best spot so you guys can see it, but it is a neutral, ouch, a neutral. Can you guys even see that on the camera? I mean, it's beautiful. It's, it's just a super light, but I think it would brighten up your eye. I'm excited for that. Once again, happy that there's no black. Then there's two of these. And these are the Animal Crossings. This is Nook Ink. And I, when I first opened it, it was like, oh, some nice greens. This is what their palette looks like. And on the back, it does give you the shades. But they do have a little protector. This is stunning. I love it. Love, love, love. Those colors are phenomenal so happy with that kind of hoping we would maybe get some of their bigger palettes but i'm not complaining and then this last one is the same animal crossings what a hoot obviously you can tell from the paint you know the box that these are more like your peachy tones cute packaging now let's take you know protective shield off and i'll protect the mirror this is adorable these are great to pack and take away with you. Just got a message on my phone. So that, and there were, like I said, I counted them prior. There are 23 items in the Mega Mystery Bundle. It says over a $200 value, and I'm sure it is. I will go back through ColourPop's website, look all this stuff up, and make sure that that is correct because not all companies are honest. I've seen that happen before, you know, oh, at least $100, we guarantee it. And then you add it up and you get pricing and it's $80. Well, so I will do my own little uh, homework here. I will list everything with the prices from the ColourPop website. And if not, I'll search them on the internet if I can't. But like, I think these are relatively on the newer side. Um, so tell me what you thought of this. I thought this was great. This is the Mega Mystery Bundle, $89. I think the other CP Confidential and Secret Stash, more affordable. Obviously, you're not going to get 23 products in there. I don't know the amount of products you'll get. I did not know that there was 23 products. Very happy with ColourPop. You can't go wrong with them. I know you could not use any discount codes if there are any floating around out there for these boxes. Generally, companies don't let you. That's okay. Um, they also offer... Um, and I don't know if any of you have heard of this. It's called Afterpay. Um, and that breaks down your purchase 
into four equal weekly payments. Let's say you get paid next week, but you want this box. You can order it today and only put one quarter, one fourth of the payment. And I think it was 20 some dollars when they broke it down um, each week. So if I like, like I get paid next week, well, I ordered this a couple weeks ago, but you know, and it came, uh, I think Friday, if, last week, Friday, uh, like if I was getting, and I do get paid next week, but if I it was this week and I wanted this box or another mystery box and I just didn't have the full $89 or $49, you can set up after pay. Some people don't like that. It's interest free. It's not a hassle. They'll take out your first payment immediately. So they'll only take out $20. Like for this, it was 22 and change or something. They'll take out $22. Now next week, they're going to take $22 back out or off your credit card or however you set it up. But if I get paid next week, I make that one payment, initial payment. And then when I get paid, I pay off the balance because I don't want it to come out every week. That would just drive me nuts. Um, but it affords you the opportunity to get something now and pay it over time. After pay is not a bad thing. You just have to remember that those payments are coming out. Uh, just like on QVC, they do easy pay and HSN does whatever they call it. Every After pay is not a bad thing. I think I did Jeffree Star's uh, mystery boxes when I got all his boxes. I think I did that on after pay. It makes it way easier to handle. Um, like I got them, made the first two payments, and then I got paid, and then I paid off the remaining balance. Then, you know, that was like three, $400 by the time I was done. Um, but something like this, you know, you has to be a $35 minimum, I do believe. But it, if you want something and you don't have the ready cash, but you have a small amount of cash, you can still get, or let's say you don't have a lot of available credit on your credit card, but you can do one payment now, and then when you get paid, make your payment and pay off your after pay or let the payments come out however you choose to do it. I think it's a great feature and a great option to have. So if you're interested in something like this, you can maybe look into that. Thank you so much everyone for watching. I hope you're all having a fantastic day and I'll see all of you in my next video. Bye-bye now.